So yeah, we're over here at that, uh, that rubbish fire and we got off the freeway and I remember um, this one from a couple days ago. There was a uh, RV fire, obviously. Um, thing was fully involved. And I'm filming, I was actually standing right there, and I hear somebody yelling. This guy comes out of nowhere and like punches me, grabs my arm. He's yelling something about filming, obviously, he's upset. And before I could even say anything, LAPD like grabs this guy, hooks him up and has him on the sidewalk in cuffs. I couldn't believe it. LAPD Hollywood, they did an amazing job. The officer told me that he was actually watching the guy and he knew that the guy was gonna do something by the way he was walking, he could tell. And I was like, that's really good police work. So they ended up hooking him up and um, unfortunately that guy spent the night in jail. But yeah, it, it's sad that he lost you know, the RV and I, I feel for that, but you can't, uh, you can't attack somebody doing their job. That's not a right thing at all. And if he had come up to me, if he had approached me and been like, hey man, that's my RV, like, you know, I'm, I'm losing everything, like, I, I get that. I maybe would have backed up or framed out or something, like, it's not a huge story, obviously, but then because he assaulted me, that then became the story. The fact that he laid hands on me, now, like, now the stations are interested. So it went from something that I might have been able to just toss and be like, all right, dude, I get it, like, I'll toss it, don't worry about it, if he was cool, to, okay, now you touched me, you put hands on me, now this is going to the stations. So. Kind of shitty, but people act uh, the way they're going to act in situations like that, and there's not much you can do about it.